Uh, um, video about um, a previous topic I touched upon in the uh, sexiest thing nurses can say to each other updates. Um, just a commentary because uh, it, 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 it just happened where I'm working three in a row. This is my second of three. And the nurse that I'm working with, well, I'm going to be taking a report from today and tomorrow is the same nurse. So uh, the person was like, oh, okay, blah, 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 blah. And I was like, oh, don't worry. I'll be here for the next two days. And they, they were like, <gasps> <laughs> it was like, oh, an audible, like sigh of relief and a sigh of happiness. It was just like, you know, <laughs> almost an almost. Uh, a romantic moment between us, and and it, he, he was like, "Oh, Ray, I love you." <laughs> and I was like, "It's okay, it's okay. I, I'll be here. I'll, I got you back. Don't worry." So it's it's definitely the best thing. I, I always suggest seeing if you can cluster your shifts together. Uh, it is tiring, no doubt about it. I, you know, it, it'll be easier for a younger nurse than an older nurse, but. It, it, it does free up my weeks uh, and, and that's really where I'm, I'm kind of going with, with this, this video is um, it, it lets me have like three to four days straight to spend with my family um, catch up on things during the week I, I tend to work the weekends and, and you might younger nurses or, or whatever you, you, you might say no I want I want the weekends for social life that's great I, you know you could definitely do that um, I have no social life, so it's, it's, <laughs> I work the weekends. It's, it's also the, the pay differential you get on the weekends. And I think that's pretty much universal. Um, but the, doing that lets me do the normal stuff during the week. Also lets me turn my clock at least temporarily. Um, although I don't advise it, I, 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 I still do it. I do turn my clock so that I'm on the same diurnal schedule as my kid, kids. Um, but I, I re really, I do it mostly for my youngest because she's still in school. Well, my next youngest is almost out of college, so that's a big differential. But I, I, I cluster my shifts so that during the week, you can be a normal person. You know, we were having this discussion last night, and night shift is like, you know, do you get angry when people wake you up in the middle of your sleep schedule? And yeah, everybody was like, yeah. Because how would you feel a normal person, you're assuming most of you are normal out there, and a normal average person doing nine to fives or, you know, sleeping dur during nights and wake up during the day. How would you like if somebody just calls you at 3 a.m. and expects you to have a decent conversation with them and expects you to do and talk over some, oh, it's just a few minutes of your time. Just a few minutes of your time. That's all. You know, and, and you know, we'll talk about this. No. Mother F. Sorry. This is my 3 a.m. You call me 3 p.m. It's it's like my you know 3 a.m. I mean whatever time you know it is. It might be daylight and you're out mowing your lawn or, or doing shopping. I'm sleeping because I work night shifts, and that is I, I something I touched on in a couple of videos was that that's the biggest adjustment for new nurses because 90 percent of us go to night shift at least initially because that's where they throw us. Um, it doesn't matter if you're a new nurse, like a year, new nurse, two years, or one month, or one week. Um, you know, you know, uh, they throw the new nurses that way. So this is more for new nurses. But even night schedule, uh, night night and ship nurses that are there for years, they know. They're, they're like, I, I don't want to take that call. I don't want to talk to whoever family. I'll talk to you at 6 p.m. You know, I woke up. That's my 6 a.m. I'm, I'm up for breakfast. At least that's that's reasonable. But I get people that say, well, I'm eating dinner. I was like, F yourself then. I don't want to talk to you. I don't need to talk to you then. Because I'm not going to talk 3 a.m. And then they're like, well, 3 a.m. I'm calling you 3 a.m. That's my 3 a.m. So, you know, um, this topic is rambling. This video is rambling a bit. It's it's originally was supposed to talk about, like, clustering your shifts. But it's also night shifts, I guess. But it allows... Again, going back to that topic, it allows you to do your regular nine to five chores, errands, you know, going to DMV, you can't do that at night. You know, I like to have that 100% online and I'm surprised it's not, but that's just the way it is for security reasons, I guess. Banking, post office, you know, whatever 
professionally have to go to tax attorneys shopping sometimes that's why 24 hour stores you'll see a whole bunch of nurses there at night they're like or or you know whatever hours cuz they're like this is when I can do it you know um on our off days we're we're up at 2 a.m. it's it's you know it's our active period we're nocturnal creatures at that point so anyway that's my little blurb out today okay just kind of rambling that's really what these videos are for you know i try to topic guys them you know put them pertaining to but sometimes i just want to ramble good luck